like, yo, I wanted to talk about the two mental battles that I see happen with these guys that they're going through too. Uh, that first mental battle, the first part of it is physical. Uh, this is because a lot of the folks that are attending Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu classes are into our beginner classes, and it usually means that they haven't done something physical in quite some time. Um, this will definitely result in soreness and muscle fatigue and things that couldn't, uh, should be expected. Uh, you're going to go through weight loss. You will you know, raise your max O2 limit, which means your cardiovascular uh, will be better, but it doesn't just start that way. It sucks for the first little bit. And uh, that's why the first part is the physical struggle. And not just the physical struggle of possibly getting your butt kicked when you go to sparring or something like that. It's, it's more about the physical struggle with yourself and with your own body. I believe that the second part, which is uh, the next six months uh, to one year of experience is gonna be the mental struggle. And this is when you have enough knowledge of Brazilian Jiu Jitsu to feel like you know things. And it's because you do, but you don't have them refined. So the mental struggle happens when you're still getting your butt kicked and you've been doing it for quite some time. Uh, being dominated by someone or strictly having to survive is very difficult for a lot of people. And uh, this is why there's a famous saying, like a Brazilian Jiu Jitsu is for everybody. And then after the first six to nine months, it's just for a few. And then after for the next few years, it's only a couple. Uh, uh, it's my goal to not make that happen. If I believe that if you're prepared for the physical and mental struggle, then you'll be better prepared to face it when that time inevitably comes. You're like, oh yeah, coach was right. This, this really did happen. Why do I keep sucking? Well, keep coming. Keep asking questions, keep being persistent, and you will break that mental and physical barrier much faster than those prescribed dates that I've given in this little video. Uh, guys, just keep training. The best way to not be the statistic of dropping out is to just continue. It's not about becoming a blue belt or a black belt. That might be the, the, the original intent, but uh, the more you do jujitsu, the more you will, you will realize that it's about just becoming a better version of yourself and that belt should be the indicator of that. All right, y'all. See you soon.